Welcome, Chef Brooke Egger from Kitchen LTO. You're smoking things up in here. <laughs> smoking them up. Let me go in. Welcome. Good to see you. So we're cooking with, what is that? Oh, we have a little short ribs here. I'm making the, uh, my version of your Frito pie that I've read so much about before I came out here. And you're from California, and Kitchen LTO, for folks who don't know, limited time only. So you're with us for how long? Uh, four months only. Wow. Yes. And then what happened? Yeah, I know. <laughs> and then, you know, that's what we're trying to figure out. I'm not quite sure yet. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But chefs love to do that, try new things. Absolutely. Okay. Try new things are fun. Okay, so you've got all this in here. You've got what? Onions, tomatoes. Is that brown sugar? Yes, ma'am. Brown sugar. And we've got some cocoa powder and then some cocoa nibs instead of dark chocolate. It was what I like to use. A little really? chili de arbol. If you want to go ahead and throw some spices in there, that would be great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want all this? Please. That would be fantastic. Is that is a little bit of... Chipotle powder, okay. a little bit of cumin, yeah. some Mexican oregano, there we go. and some garlic. You doing all the garlic? Yes. Oh yeah. You are and jalapenos. The, you're getting into the uh, into the Texas thing here. Yeah, for absolutely. A California you guys girl, have some huh? big flavors that I like a lot. Right, right. And so the concept of uh, Kitchen LTO is you kind of come here, you you do whatever the heck you want in a space over in uh, Trinity Groves. Yes. Which is an amazing concept, isn't it? It's an absolutely fantastic concept. Yeah. I think it's super fun. I went over there the, the first time the other night, and it was great because everyone's sitting on the patios. There's like nice eating, you know, outdoor eating places, and then each of the little restaurants along the way, too. Uh, it, it's turned out to be such a hot spot. It is turned out to be a hot spot. It's a fun thing to be a part of, for sure. Yeah, I bet. Mm -hmm. I bet. Okay, so how long does this take to cook up? Uh, you, this part right here is just the simmering part, and then you go ahead and put it in the oven for another two hours until the short ribs are nice and soft. Super easy for the home cook. Okay. One pot, set it, forget it. Okay. Come back. Now, when I go to the meat department, what exactly do I ask for? Short ribs. Just short ribs. Yes. It doesn't matter. Just beef short Anything, ribs. And that's that they should know what to get. Okay, yeah. nice. And after two hours, that's going to fall off the bone. That's right? going to fall off the bone. You've got that. Yeah. And yeah. how long does it go in the oven for? Two hours? About an hour and a half, two hours until it's shredding off the bone. Like at what time? About 350, and you want to go ahead and make sure it's covered? Cover it. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. But could you leave it in the skillet like that? Yes, I would prefer to leave it in the skillet because you get those nice juices from the sear. Nice flavor. Right. Yeah. Right. Absolutely. Oh. And then what would you like to serve it with? Uh, I'll some blue corn tortilla chips for color and then a little smoke smoked creme fraiche. You can get the creme fraiche at any grocery store. Uh, you can also use sour cream and then a little bit of redneck cheddar that I found here in Texas that I had never seen before and some chopped chives. How fun. And so what is the concept of your limited time only restaurant over in Trinity Groves? Well, I've kind of lived everywhere around the world, so I do uh, what I call urban regional. It's where I am at the time. I like to study menus and the foods of the area and then bring in my little hints of flair from around the world. That's so you, fun. You've been yeah. scouting the competition then. A little bit. Yeah. <laughs> but that's, just, that's fun. That's a ton of fun. Yeah. Nice to see. So, okay, so you can get the recipe on our website and uh, check out check out that Kitchen LC at four months then, huh? Yes, ma'am. Four months. All right. Very exciting. The recipe's on the web and a link as well. We will be right back with the forecast.